Now, as a OLTA service is ready for the sales order header details, now we'll create a Fiori application from the template using Business Application Studio in BTB Trial Account. So, after logging to BTB Trial Account, click on Business Application Studio. And here, as the seller is stopped, so click on this icon to start the data space. It is starting. This may take some time to start the data space. Now it is running. So once the status is running in green color, click on our data space. Now here, by default, we can see this welcome screen. If not, what we can do, click here, file, and then new project from template. Okay, so there also we'll get the same screen. So here select start from template. Then select SAP Fury application. Click on start. Loading the template selection. Here I will go with the list report page. Okay, there are different type of templates available like basic template, list report, overview page, analytical list page, etc. So here first for demo, I will go with list report page. Click on next. Here we have to select the data source and the service selection. First select the data source. Here, as you already configure S4HANA on-premise system, so I will connect to a system. In case you want to directly call OLTA service with the help of URL, then you can use this option, connect to an OLTA service. So here, as our backend system is already configured, so I will select connect to a system. And in the next step, we have to select our system, which we have configured with the help of Cloud Connector. So here as a system is SAP underscore BTP underscore S for HANA. After selecting the system, we'll get the option to select the OLTA service. As my OLTA service is ZK underscore sales underscore SRV. So here you can start typing our name. So ZK underscore sales underscore SRV. Because the system is already connected, system automatically show the other services. Click on next. Main entity, as we have only single entity, so we can go ahead with this ZSO header set. With the project name. Let's say, you all in small sales report app title sales order report description keep as it is or change so here we can give different parts by default we'll get a part like this slash home slash user slash projects so this is the part project folder where our project for uh, project will get stored okay so we'll keep standard as it is slash home slash user slash project okay keep remaining all as it is and click on finish so you can see here installing dependency so system is generating the new project based on the configuration which we have done now Project home user project sales report is not in current project space. Okay. Let's say add project to workspace. So here we can see 
in his work space or project self report is added okay we can see different before this demo i tried one more uh, project that's why you can see here z can do scalable tv cells now i created this one self report okay so here right click and click on preview application and then select start fury run to run the application i can see in a new window our application is getting open as i not added any annotations in the oeta services also this is not a cds based oeta service so and i not added any annotation file here so that's why what we have to do click here and select all the columns which we required to display on the screen select okay and then click on go see here you can see all the columns based on our oeta service as we have selected 10 records and you can see the same columns on the web screen so very simple in a quick time just between 5 to 10 minutes if our oeta service is ready so easily we can create this fury application from template so this is how we can create a fury application on business application studio now suppose we have done with the project creation and after that again you want to search okay and if you are not able to see this work space so once you log in just click here on the explore okay so once you click here so we'll get all the details on left hand side and then you can start testing your application so in this way you are done with a complete step by step guide of configuring the btb trial account then installing of the cloud connector then establishing a connection between cloud connector and trial account as well as on premises as well as a system and finally using the oeta service we have developed the simple basic list report which is displaying here the sales order header details like this do the practice by creating different oeta service and try to add some annotation also so in this way we done with this session thank you